Hello today, and today we're going to be doing a comparison between um, the new uploader on YouTube and the classic uploader on YouTube. Um, it's not a speed test or anything like that, it's just a comparison of what both look like. So let's upload a very small video of something, something I know is going to take no time at all. So we just upload an old intro and we're the same with this one will upload an old intro because I know they're short and they won't take next to no time to upload so let's have a look at the comparison show you the details right um so you can have up to it tells you you can have up to 100 characters on the detail so we're going to leave that there um so descriptions we'll put test n for new and test c for classic so you can do your tags um, so you've got your tags underneath it on the classics um, and that's not on the same page as the, um, the new on the new one um, so we can select the playlist the playlist is here which we're not going to do where you can select if you want it public unlisted on this page and there's your playlist so you can pretty much do everything on this one what you need to do also choose your thumbnail um yes you can you once you can do that with um the new one as well so we got um so we named it put your tags in so the next one is monetization on this one where it is on the third one on the um, classic one but i'm not going to worry about that video enhancement so this is on the new one add an end screen if you want to add cards if you want to don't know if you could do that on the classics one because that's something I've never done so with this one classic so you can do translation if you want to translations if you want to have a um, um, do um, convert the language as a subtitle I'm guessing and um, so you've got that option if you want to but that's something else I never do so well, let's have a look at visibility so Oh yes, yeah, details on the first one, something I didn't tell you because I have to scroll down. Um, with the new one, you can have, um, yes, it's made for kids. No, it's not for, made for kids. All this copper stupidity. My kit, my channel's always going to be set for, no, it's not made for kids because I don't, my, child, my, my, my channel is not appealed for kids. So you can enter your age restriction, more options. So paid promotions tags oh, so you can enter your tags on the first screen okay on the new one language so you can pretty do quite do a lot on the first screen so you can have english you know king no caption form captioning record date location or you can set it to your country if you want but it should already be default i don't know why that isn't um video location so this is all new so yeah i suppose this is better in some ways because it's all on one page license yes and, and yes yeah, so you've got quite a lot on one page which is good so you can set all that here you do have to go across varied things so advanced settings so i can choose my category but yeah because the majority of them are gaming so i can choose that to whatever i want so you can choose what game you're uploading but it's only it can only work if it's on the YouTube database otherwise you can't just put any random game in if it's not there then it won't come up recording date yes you can choose that so you can do all this stuff which I don't really tend to use anyway so with this one once it's done you can just go to publish um, let's just change it to unlisted so people don't click on the video so we can publish that and let's go to this one the new one um, so you can go to publish now because once again I can it's, it's defaulted on unlisted for some reason um, so let's just go to publish now okay um, so I guess you just push done and it just okay So I did push done on that one, sure I did, done to confirm. Right, with this one, it takes you back 
um, to the videos. But why doesn't the new one have this option? So this is the option I really want on the new one. So where you can send your videos to Twitter without cut and copying the paste. So where is that option on the new one? Why isn't it there? Why have they got rid of it? Or is it somewhere completely different now? So where I can choose, put it on Facebook and send it to different links on Facebook. Send my links to different Facebook groups or pages if I wanted to. That option ain't there on the new one. Why is that? Why hasn't the new one got this option? Because that's the option that I want. And this is the reason why I still upload with classics. Because it's still got this option and the new one hasn't. So where is it, YouTube? Where is that Where is that on the new one? Why get rid of it if you haven't put it on there? Put it back. Please put that back on the new one. That's all I wanted to show you. But yeah, I think I would get used to the new one. But the only grip I have... It doesn't have this, which I do use to send it to Twitter, to different Facebook pages and groups. So why isn't that on the new one? I like to see that feature there, and then I would be, then I would like to use the new one. Now I can get used to it, but no, they don't have this option. Where is it? If it's somewhere, I've got to find it. Okay, please someone tell me, but it would be nice and convenient to have it after the uploading. But no, we haven't got it. So I wanted to say, wanted to, so I really wanted to do a video about it, actually, where is this? Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.